I'm right there with you because at least. All right, I now call to order the new Carlisle City Council meeting, Monday, April 2nd, 2018 at 7 p.m. If you have your cell phones, uh, just put them on vibrate. And Mrs. Berner. Mayor Reynolds. Here. Mr. Lighty. Here. Mr. Lowry. Here. Mr. Shammy. Here. Mr. Cobb. Here. Mr. Cook. Here. Vice Mayor Lindsay. Six members present. We have an invocation night from Councilman Aaron Lighty. Bow our heads. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for the opportunity for us to be here tonight, Lord. Uh, God, we ask that you bless this city, bless our first responders, our police force, Lord, and just help every decision made here tonight and in the future. Uh, bless you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. We use our flag on the back here. To the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, action on the minutes. So moved. Second. Okay. Discussion? Mr. Lowry. Yes. Mr. Shammy. Yes. Mr. Cobb. Yes. Mr. Cook. Yes. Mayor Reynolds. Yes. Mr. Lighty. Yes. Passes six zero. Do you have another one for the town hall meeting? So moved. Second. Who was? Okay. Mr. Shammy. Yes. Mr. Cobb. Yes. Mr. Cook. Yes. Mayor Reynolds. Yes. Mr. Lighty. Yes. Mr. Lowry. Yes. Six to zero. Alrighty. Uh, communication is done tonight. City so Manager report. Mr. Bridge. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Uh, members of council, members of the public. I'd like to share with you the city manager's report and uh, jumping on down to informational items. Uh, I know it's been on here for the past few meetings. I just want to keep it on for a little bit longer. Online ut utility payments for your water bill. You can now pay them online, but please go to www.newcarlisle.net to pay that bill. If you do not pay that bill through our website, you will be using what we call third party vendors and it will have a great uh, ability to maybe delay your payment getting to us. So again, um, you pay through www.newcarlisle.net, which is our city's website and your payment will be posted the next day. Planning board meeting is set for April 26th and it will be at 6.30 p.m. and it'll be at the fire station and it'll be discussed the following. Uh, Twin Creeks Covenants, we know that the Homeowners Association in Twin Creeks is in the process of disbanding. Uh, in those covenants, it states that if it does disband, the city would overtake certain aspects of those covenants. So the procedure is that planning board will meet first. They'll decide what parts of that, um, of those covenants they want to bring over. And we're looking at primary things like um, the lot size or the setbacks where your principal house is and how much feet you gotta have between your property lines. We're looking at square footage because we really do want to protect the existing housing stock that's up there. We don't want someone to go up there and buy a parcel of land and put a 700 square foot home up there. We definitely do have, do have some interest in preserving what is already in place. Um, so after the planning board makes their recommendations, it will be brought forth to city council for their final approval. So again, 26, we will have the planning board meeting. Um, we'll also be discussing some um, um, uh, uh, information regarding Madison Street School. I'll be sending a memo out to city council this week regarding that. Uh, but we do have, um, trying to gauge how solid a, of an interest it is in. But we do have some people who are interested in that facility, tearing it down and putting um, 55 and plus condominiums there. So again, that starts with the planning board. Everything will be finally approved through city council if it comes to that. Um, and then there will, uh, will be some potentially other items on there, uh, namely a, a, a business that is looking at North Main Street, and it's a dog burner. Um, I have not received her paperwork back yet, so if that does come in by the deadline, uh, we'll be discussing that as well. So uh, planning board's gonna have a pretty active meeting on the 26th. Um, normally these meetings do begin at 3.30, but we opted to do it at 6.30, so people who work there today would have time to attend. Um, New Carlisle Health Stats is attached, and these are for January and February. And then on 
Tuesday, April 24th, I will have a Rotary speaking event, um, and I will be talking about the 2017 and 2018 financials for the city of New Carlisle, um, and that is, I do believe, at Sacred Heart Church. Um, Great American Cleanup is a fantastic way to um, help clean up your uh, city. That is underway until May 31st, 2018. Um, you can call Linda Mitchell at 937-521-2023, and you call her to say, I want to go help clean up New Carlisle, and then what you can do is stop by the city building and we will provide you with the necessary items to complete your cleanup request. Future legislation. Um, may see legislation amending our income tax rules and regulations. This is due to House Bill 49, and we are anticipating an April 6, 2018 council read on those. Um, and I do believe that is all I have for my city manager's report. I'd be happy to entertain any questions. Council? Anything? Okay. All right. Thank you, Mr. Bridge. Thank you. Moving on to comments from members of the public. Does anyone have any comments? <laughs> Any reports that are done tonight? Mrs. Byrne. All right, we do not have any resolutions or ordinances this evening. Other business, Congressman Warren Davidson will hold the mobile office hours at the city building on the fourth Tuesday of each month from 1.30 p.m. until 2. The Crime Watch meeting will be held here at Smith Park Shelter House April 11th at 6.30 p.m. The intergovernmental meeting will be held April 30th here at the Smith Park Shelter House at 6.30 and Someone would like to. Can I ask a question? I'm yes. so sorry to interrupt the process. Go ahead. With the intergovernmental meeting, I think you and I had briefly discussed. We are responsible for supplying food. Yeah. Is it okay if I just do what we've normally done before and have the least cater? Yeah. Is, is that okay with everyone? I think it's fine. Yeah. I don't want to cook and bring anything. <laughs> <laughs> so we're good with least. Yes. Okay. Sounds good. Cannot be for the whole year because I think we have we host two of these two two, two, two a year. Yeah, that's We're okay for both. Is everyone fine with that? With Lee's catering for us? Yep. Okay. Thank you. All right. Sorry, Ms. Burr. Oh, you're fine. Um, we need to excuse Vice Mayor Lindsay from the meeting this evening. Make, make a motion. We excuse Vice Mayor. Yeah. yeah. Vice Mayor Lindsay from the meeting. Second. Second. Who wants it? Uh, Mayor Reynolds. Yes. Mr. Lighty. Yes. Mr. Lowry? Yes. Mr. Shammy? Yes. Mr. Cobb? Yes. Mr. Cook? Yes. Excuse, six to zero. All right, council, do you have anything else on the business? Yeah, but uh, any of the council members get the chance to look at that uh, mm -hmm. book there, I can them out. I have reviewed it, yes. I've reviewed it, yes. Okay. I didn't know whether we wanted to set a work session for next Monday. I'm still waiting on hearing back from Parks and Rec. Has anyone else reached out to any other committees? Because we want to do it with all the committees all at once, correct? Isn't that the goal? That's what I was going to Man, well, let's. Uh, what? What? They're talking about the Parks and Rec Board Committee? We're talking about all the committees. That was <laughs> Mr. Cook had submitted the booklet to us for to have all the committees be governed underneath. So, I think How many committees do we have? Do we have the Parks and Rec Committee? But the Planning Board and Board of Zoning Appeals are charter issues, so they won't be able to do anything with the Planning Board at BZA. And other than that, and the Tax Review Board is set by our charter, so it might just be the Parks and Rec. Well, that Parks makes it real Rec. easy then. That's the well, well, let me go through and check the list that we have, and then I will definitely send an email out to everyone. As soon as you know, let me know, and mm -hmm. we'll get that meeting scheduled so we can get this done. Yeah, sure. we can follow that at any time. So, All right. Once we get the dates. Very good. All right. Is that all right, Mr. Cook? I All right. All right. Ex Council, anything else? If the executive session is none tonight. And Mr. Mayor. Yes. I'll make a motion we adjourn. No, we need a second. 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 All right. We are adjourned. Yeah. I think we did our whole thing.